afternoon world we are entering the enchanted river once again it is super noisy there's june june hi june june <laughs> let's feel the water oh it's cold it is cold <laughs> story is super excited because she's gonna get a chance to swim now Yay. looking forward to it story can finally swim in the Enchanted River. <laughs> so every day at 12 o'clock they do a big yes, fish feeding every, event, right? Every day, every day. Yeah. They feed the fish. So while we were out, we missed this, but Jun Jun thankfully recorded it for us on the phone. Yeah. Oh, the bell is ringing. Welcome everyone to yes. Enchanted River. They show their gratitude to Mother Nature by giving an offering to the spirits of the underground spring. The spirits underground are spring. Here, how we Everyone. Give back to the environment and take care of Mother Nature. Nature. Wow, I was hoping that it would still be nice and sunny here after our little island hopping trip that we unexpectedly took but look at that still beautiful sunshine we're just going to get changed put our swimmers on and jump into the water story's super excited so they've actually got changing rooms here comfort rooms they're called aren't they crs yeah also toilet <laughs> yep if you need that just got another glimpse of the epic pool oh it's amazing isn't it it's so weird it kind of looks like a hologram How deep it is. this is obviously where the freshwater spring comes from it mixes with the seawater so for us right now it is 1.30 in the afternoon on a Thursday. We just missed the fish feeding about 12 o'clock but you can already see how many people are here enjoying the Enchanted River so it's good to see that people are still here you know. It means that the attraction is still making some money. It's also good to see that you still get some sunlight here at this time of the day. Oh, <laughs> oh you actually managed to get a nice picture. <laughs> You've been taking silly selfies? Yeah. Yeah? passing the time because you're excited to go in the pool yeah it's just very really, really, <laughs> one of our subscribers yeah no, watches no, no, the no, video no, no, no. <laughs> we've met quite a few today actually a few people have seen us yeah, today yeah yeah no, i didn't expect this there's so many subscribers yeah, yeah. <laughs> she is the highlight oh <laughs> ah, ah. you came from general santos eh well that's a long way yeah yeah this is the plan yeah we want to see as much as we can <laughs> whoa is it super cold <laughs> Don't worry, you'll soon warm up. This is my yeah, you have to jump in quickly. Alright, Stormy's done it, so I've got to do it. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> yeah, that was the way you were supposed to do it. You're going in too slowly. Quick, quick. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Sasha hates doing that. <laughs> Alright, it's my turn now. <laughs> That's probably me too. Whoa, super strong. Goodness me. There's a reason why this rope is here. I'm not sure how much of this you're going to hear, but there is a super strong current here. Like, I'm trying to walk against it now, and I basically can't. I don't know if I'd be able to swim against it. Look, just staying in one place. <laughs> How's it feel, Story? Nice. Yeah. Cold. Cold. <laughs> it was cold when we first got in, wasn't it? But yeah. it's really nice and refreshing now. Yeah, it's got nice. I can't believe how strong this current is. I wonder if it ever changes. Oh, <laughs> uh, you want to see the moth? Yeah. Just check. 
crazy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna see how fast this current is. So I'm standing in the middle now and it's actually pulling my feet away from under me. Look at that sky. Wow. Cannot beat the colour of this water. So it's going to go under. Are you going to show us? Are you still having fun, Story? Yeah. yeah. I actually feel quite warm now. Yeah. It's amazing how quickly your body temperature it's stabilizes. It's lovely now. <laughs> Push you? What, like a swing? Yeah. Let me see what it looks like under there. Crazy girl. You're going to float to me. You coming? <laughs> you made it. I'm going to float to mum. Yeah, I can't float to mum. You have to swim to mum. I've been asked to float away again so she can swim to me or float to me. You ready? I'm in position. Here comes the water girl. <laughs> Nearly there. <laughs> you went past me, look. <laughs> you went right, right under the road. <laughs> You missile! Yeah. Hey, go back under, yeah? Did, did you throw me under? Yeah, I think so. Do you want to do it again? Wow! What a little missile you are! Yeah. You can teach us one word? Uh, oh, nice. And you are? Oh, yeah. You're called Ate. Alright, the Enchanted River shuttle has returned for us. I was a bit goofy. I got into the water with my t-shirt on and this is the only t-shirt I've got today. So, I'm soaking wet and I'm going to be soaking wet for hours and hours in the car. We have to take it off when we get in the van. Yeah, we'll be shirtless on the way. Yeah, it might get a bit cold. <laughs> Bye bye Enchanted River. Whoa, it's a bouncy ride. It's a bouncy ride. Did you see that toilet? Yeah. That, that toilet just fell down. <laughs> ah, feels good to be in the sunshine again. Warming up. That was good fun. <laughs> bye. Thank you for everything. Jump. <laughs> Whee. Wow, look at those blue skies. I'm actually quite amazed at how many people they've been here today. Super busy. If anybody is thinking of coming here and flying a drone, there's actually some rules against that now. You're not allowed to fly any drones over the Enchanted River because apparently somebody came here and tried to do some flying and crashed into the lake and it smashed somebody in the head. So obviously they weren't an experienced flyer and because of that nobody's allowed to fly drones here now. I was planning on getting some nice shots, but it doesn't matter. We managed to go to that lovely island in the end. And this is probably Story's like 30th picture of the day. <laughs> it's easy to make friends here, isn't it, Story? <laughs> All right, it's time to say bye-bye Enchanted River. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything. See you, bye. Well, that was good timing. Look at that, the rains have just come and hit us hard. We got lucky. So we were supposed to be going to Tinoyan Falls, yeah. right? but it's uh, closed yeah. today. So instead we're at the Beto Lagoon, and apparently there's lots of hot and cold springs here, which is like, a, these Betos are like big wells, aren't they? Yeah, like big really wells, deep. They're really deep. Okay, so I'm gonna have a look and see what it looks like. This one's drawing a crowd. Is there something here?
the water came up. Do people yeah. swim here then? Or not in this one? Yeah. People don't swim in this one. They, you could swim. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Someone just jumped yeah. in over there. Yeah. So they're like cold springs, yeah? Yes. Or fresh spring water. Uh, so this section here is protected because yeah, of the, the and fish, then, yeah? And you can swim on the other side. On the other side. I see, okay. So deep in here, full of fish. It's clear now. This is the swimming side, isn't it? Yeah. You can hear. Yeah. It's quite big, actually. Yeah, it's a, like a swimming pool. Yeah, it's like a, a natural, natural swimming pool. It's like a big, big swimming pool, yeah. slash river, slash fresh spring. <laughs> <laughs> Mixture of everything. Yeah, it's very cold. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it's very Enchanted cold. River was cold as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there we go. The sun has come out for us to show us the color of the water. It's looking good. Looking quite inviting actually. If I hadn't already been swimming, I think I would enjoy it. <laughs> Look at that, nice. You can see how clear the water is here. No fish on this side, so it's okay to swim. Oh, the fish, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, there's some over on that side. Put some net so that the, all the dirt, the, the garbage cannot go inside. Yeah, they keep it clean. The Bogak Cold Spring, this is cold. So you can see it's another very popular area, like considering we are on a Thursday now, it's like, what, three o'clock in the afternoon? <laughs> There's still quite a few people here enjoying the waters, going for swimming. You can also see the amount of tricycles parked here. So there's probably lots of people coming from locally. And this is good too. Look, they're keeping the environment clean, keeping the plastic out. This little town of Barabo is one of those places that I would never have discovered on my own. It's not on the tourist trail at all. It's a proper local gem. Just looking at the town, you can see this is where people are living. This is where people are enjoying their weekend. It's a proper picnic spot. I presume around the mountains here where all of the waterfalls and springs are, you get a lot of these cold springs. And there's so much to discover like this all over Mindanao. But up until now, Mindanao has never really been on the tourist radar. Even the Enchanted River has only been made popular recently. But all you need to do is take a look around and see what's here to realize there's so much for us to see, so much for us to do. I'm looking at this trip that we're doing here as a preview. It's currently not easy to travel at the moment. There's a lot of restrictions and there's a lot going on. It's kind of like a sneak peek of what is to come, you know. We could spend a lot longer in each area properly exploring these places, but we need some more time. We need less restriction, but for now, just getting this little hint of what Mindanao could be is making us excited for what's available in the future. Wow, look at that sunshine. The new morning here, Butuan. It's a promising start to the day. Looking forward to getting on the road and seeing something new today. We're heading into the mountains. First of all, breakfast. I like the location for breakfast story. Did you choose this location? Mm. Mummy chose the table, yeah? Good choice, Mummy. <laughs> yeah, have a nice view. Yeah. The sun's on the pool now, so it's looking really inviting, actually. It does. <laughs> Shame we're not going in. Yeah, we're all showered and ready to go. We've got peanut butter toast and some I watermelons. Showered. Yeah, we showered, didn't we? We found some Skippy peanut butter in the 7-Eleven yesterday, so we bought that, added it to the toast. Going to be a tasty breakfast. <laughs> How's the watermelon? Watermelon. Yeah, I can see that. We're going to end today's video. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. 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 Yeah.